Hi, welcome to today's Tuesday tip. Today's tip is going to be on the IRS mileage rate. As you know, or if you did not know, again, December the 17th, 2021, the IRS changed the mileage rate. The mileage rate is important to us for three reasons. Number one, we give a medical expense on mileage rate for our senior citizens. Number two, we have residents who are employed. A lot of them are doing the Uber runs or the food jobs and they have delivery. They can claim an independent business and take the mileage off of that business. So, first of all, the 58.5% per mile driven is for businesses and business use only. The second one, which is most important to most of the senior properties, is the mileage for medical. The new mileage for medical is going to be 18 cents per mile. That's from the residence unit to the doctor's office or to the facility that they're going to get service at. The medical expense mileage is for transportation from the residency to the doctor's office and the return trip. So if you're an owner or a manager, you might want to Google the distance between your property and the doctor's office because that's all they get credit for. The last one is for social services. It's for community services. For instance, um, there are a lot of people who drive for the elderly that do the food bank drive. And if that's the case, that has not changed. It has been the same for the last three or four years. So keep in mind these expenses. Thank you so much for tuning in, and we look forward to seeing you again on another Tuesday Tip.